Hey, what is up, guys? One with a beard here, and today I'm bringing you a video of me snipering in Invasion. Now, this video was requested by a friend of mine who wants to see how good I am at snipering. So, yeah, gave it a go. So, he knows who he is. This one's for you. You requested it a while back. I said, give me a week, although. It hasn't really been a week, but yeah, um, I've hardly played this game, I'll be honest with you. I'm always on Xbox One, as you guys can tell from my channel. And um, yeah, so I think this was my first game I decided to jump into. And obviously I'm always recording just in case anything good does happen. And in this situation it did. I actually win the game. So yeah. And I know you might be thinking, wait, that's not really quick scoping, you're hard scoping. Yeah, like, yo, I told you I'm going to put out a video of me snipering, not quick scoping or no scoping or whatever. Like, when I'm using a sniper, I tend to do whatever works. So, if I'm using a sniper and I want to hard scope, hey, I hard scope. If I don't think I'm going to make a kill, yeah, why not? But, you know, that's how it goes. And, um,. Recently, as I've been playing, I actually recorded this a while back, so you're getting it, I think, um, I'm not too sure, I think, like, it's been two weeks since I've recorded this, but I haven't, like, given myself the opportunity or chance to actually come on and record a commentary over it, so you are getting this kind of late, but anyways, apart from that, I've been playing Modern Warfare 2 for a while now. You know, just to get in the mood of throwing it back a bit, you know, that Advanced Warfare is not really my cup of tea right now. I'm not really liking the EXO movements and all of that. Like, like, it, like Call of Duty is like a war game. And if you're throwing it too far into the future, like Advanced Warfare has, it kind of kills the whole atmosphere and the whole gameplay of... Call of Duty itself. I mean, I started at playing Call of Duty from uh, Modern Warfare, as in Call of Duty 4, and I love that. So that's why I've stuck to the franchise itself. I haven't played Call of Duty 1 to 3 yet, and I don't think I'm ever going to get that opportunity. But yeah, I actually got Call of Duty 4 after Call of Duty World at War came out, which was the fifth Call of Duty of the franchise. So I got it after that. I never really played World at War that much. Like there's gonna be a few videos coming out soon of some World at War gameplay. But and and sorry, not but but in those videos you'll be able to see that I'm still rank I don't know I think like 30 or 20 something like that I'm, like I don't really play that game the reason I got that game was for zombies and in Black Ops 3 obviously I'm gonna get it mainly for zombies I'm not really a huge fan on in Black Ops or World at War so I'm just getting it for zombies mainly and also Black Ops 3 Apparently that's going to be futuristic. Not too sure how it's going to be, like how the gameplay is going to be. If it's going to be like Advanced Warfare, I'm really not going to enjoy it. I'm going to mainly just play Zombies. But even that, Zombies is kind of dead when it's with that EXO movement like in Advanced Warfare. Like that, that, that just killed it. Like the Zombies are too powerful. Um, EXO Medic is useless basically. Like... Why not throw it back to getting some Juggernaut, where Juggernaut actually did really help. Um, but yeah, now we're getting to near the ending of the gameplay. So, you notice I was mainly chilling in that castle or base or that house, whatever you want to call it. The drug house, I guess. I don't know. But um, yeah, that was like really my main spot. That's where you get all the action coming at you. I don't know why I tried 360 here, like, first time snipering after a long time and I'm trying to 360, that's not really a good decision, but 
I decided not to go with the 360. I mean, if I didn't go for the 360, I would have ended the game a lot more quicker. But, you know, sometimes you get a bit too excited and things happen. But yeah, this is the last kill. There you go, win the game. I think I get 30 to 8 deaths, I believe. Not too sure, but yeah, my friend, this is for you. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching and peace out.